Hello all. Many a times we get requirement of parsing the PDF files to do some analysis. So what you can see on my desktop is a Uber bill. So this is my personal Uber bill. So what I will show you in this video is how do you extract the needed information from a PDF file using Python. Okay. So from this file, I need some information like invoice number, invoice date, and what is the invoice amount. So how do we extract the needed information that I'm going to show you step by step process using Python. Welcome to Unfold Data Science. This is Aman here and I'm a data scientist. I welcome you to the NLP series of my channel. Okay. Now, if we go to Python here, what you can see is I am just setting the working directory to one of my folder on the desktop. Okay. So in my desktop, I have kept a folder over bills. So when you go to my desktop, you can see this folder over bills. So I have lot of bills here. Okay. So there are like 10, 12 bills here. So what I will do is I will try to fetch all these information that I just mentioned for all these files using Python. Okay. So I'm just setting the working directory to that Uber bills directory. Now in this block of code, it is very important to understand what I am doing. Okay. So just pay little attention here. Now I'm using a package called PyPDF2. So there are other packages also which are helpful in extracting the information from the PDF file. In this case, I'm using PyPDF2. You can use PDF minor and other packages as well. In this line, what I'm doing is I'm just taking the list of all the files from that directory. Okay. So os.listdir means give me the list of all the files in that directory. So what file underscore list will have is it will have the name of all these files. Okay. And now I'm running a for loop over all those files. So when I run a for loop over all these files, what happens is first file will come in the first iteration of the for loop. And I'm saying open directory name plus file name in RB mode. RB mode means I want to read the information from that file. Okay. So I'm opening that file. What I'm doing next, I'm just taking this variable F and reading it using PyPDF package, which I had imported before. Okay. So I'm saying PyPDF2 dot PDF file reader. So PDF file reader is a function of PyPDF2 and I want to you know, read the content of that file. So now I have a reader object. So next what I will do is I will go and say reader dot get page zero, which means start from the beginning and extract taste text. So extract all the text and split on this character. So this character is nothing but new line character. So if you see here in the bills, all these information are in new new lines. Okay. So this is one line, this is other line, this is third line. So that is the reason I want to extract line by line everything. Now I have all the information line by line in this variable five underscore contents. Okay. I'm initializing three variables here. So as I told in the beginning, I need three information from this file. One is invoice number, one is invoice date and third is gross amount. So when I come here, I run another for loop. So what I'm saying in this for loop is for I in range of length of file content. So what will be in file contents? In file contents, there will be all the information line by line. So how many ever lines are there in the file for all those lines run this for loop. Okay. And what to do if you find keyword invoice number, that is what is the instruction I'm giving to my machine. If you find invoice number keyword, then split the content on column. So what will happen is it will come here, see this line. Okay. And it will find the content invoice number and it will split this line on colon. So when it splits on colon, what will be the uh, first character invoice number? What will be the second character? This number. So in Python, it will be 0th index invoice number and first index this bill number. Okay. 0th number will be invoice number in English or words. And this number actually TNJB will be in the uh, first index. So that, that is the reason I'm saying here split by colon and take the first index. So this is important guys. How do you extract the needed information from a text data? So I need the first index thing from this text file. Okay. And I'm searching using invoice number. Okay. And I have previously broken by line by line. So what happens if I need invoice date? I will just say, go to the line and see if you find the key invoice date. If you find that break on the colon. Okay. 
and when you break take the first element and call that as invoice date so that is what i am doing here if you find invoice date go and break and take the first element call that as date okay when this for loop runs again and again for all the lines of the file we get all three information and then i am printing that information okay this is one file processing and this for loop runs for all the file one by one and that is the reason when i run this entire for loop i get all the information for different files so this will be the bill number for the first file so if you can see here it is processing the files and it is putting all the information bill number date so if you go and if i go and open 9th july file so the name of my file here is 9th july 1 so if i come here and open 9th july 1 then that information should be here so 9 july 2019 is the bill number so file number is not populating here but from the invoice number we can see 536.09 so probably this is the result for that 9th july bill okay so tnjbjufb that should be the invoice number so tnjbjufb invoice number okay so that is how we are extracting the information from multiple pdf files now why this is important is in my personal experience i have seen lot of times uh, you know in in data science projects you will have to parse multiple documents so i have worked in a project where we had to parse like 10000 pdf files and then we had to combine all the information to do some analysis so this is how you can extract the information from a pdf file and other kind of files also like json file word file so i have kept a simple example of word file parsing so if you see here this is one file that i have created on my desktop this is a sample text file which i want to parse in python my file contains a b c x y z okay so i come here and i just import a package doc to text i change this directory to desktop because that file is directly available on the desktop and i just say doc to text dot process this file okay and when i run this you can see that all the information is coming in the result variable you go here and make some change i am changing this file for demo okay i am changing i am saving i come here i rerun this and you can see the new information i am changing this file for demo okay so this is how you can parse multiple files now i have shown you pdf and word other uh, varieties of file also can be passed in python so including this i have completed two sets of uh, data import technique in nlp one was from the web and this one is from the different file types now i'll move on to the next steps in nlp i'll start with basic nlp jargons and uh, nlp faqs so what are the what is a corpus what is tokenization what is meant by dtm how to clean the data in nlp world so all the topics i'm going to cover one by one so stay tuned to unfold data science i'll see you all in the upcoming videos let me know through likes and comments how did you like this video till then stay safe and take care